Destroys black metal material. Harold kills a member of the board, but stabs, but stages it as a suicide and denies his involvement with Joy. She convinces the board to reinstate the Meachams and Danny. Danny refuses it to return to Kung Long until the hand is destroyed, and Davos questions his motives. He and Davos visit the temple, where she is able to remove the shrapnel or procure his weapon from Danny's room, but does not have the antibiotics required to control the infection. Uh, Wing arrives and tries to reason with Danny. She tries to, to prove her feelings for him by using her connection to the hand to a hand member at a hospital to get antibiotics for his wound. Danny goes to the penthouse where Joy has discovered that Bakuda has been transferring Rand Enterprise's money to his own accounts. Harold decides to kill Bakuda and formulates a plan to flush him and his operatives out of the, of the compound by having Joy freeze their accounts. Danny agrees to help Harold kill Bakuda, but Joy is against this. The hand captures um, Wing and takes her to the compound, where Danny and Davos wait for Bakuda to emerge. Joy freezes the accounts as Wing frees herself and escapes. Danny rushes to Wing rather than wait, waiting for Bakuda, revealing his, uh, his feelings for her to Davos. Ward escapes the hospital and goes to the penthouse and tries to get Joy away from Harold. Bakuda and his operatives arrive with the former shooting Joy and giving Danny half an hour to arrive at the penthouse to save the Meachams. Against Davos' objections, Danny decides to go and arrives before Bakuda and uh, decapitates Harold, which would kill him for good. Danny uses the power of the Iron Fist to fight off the hand operatives as Davos and Wing arrive to help. Wing confronts Bakuda, overpowering him, but refuses to kill him. Danny also refuses but Davos does not, doesn't. But Davos doesn't. In a range, Danny attacks Davos and defeats him, but spares him. Davos reveals his jealousy that Danny was chosen to be the Iron Fist, and his rage that Danny abandoned the sacred duty of the Iron Fist to protect Kong Mung. Davos leaves Danny, and we find Bakuda's body missing. Harold and War take Joy to, the, to a hospital. The next day, um, Ward and Danny, um, Ward warns Danny that he has spent, he has been set up by Harold. Just as DA agents arrive at the dojo, Danny and we fight them off and escape. Uh, Harold takes control of Rand Enterprises. Rand and Wing go to the academy, now abandoned by the head, where Gal reveals that Harold masterminded the plane crash that killed Danny's parents. Ward Tells Joy about Harold's actions and confronts him about him. Harold denies framing Danny and Joy decides to leave. Ward allies with Danny, Wing, and Temple to help defeat Harold. He goes to Rand Enterprises where he is wounded by Harold, um, but is able to find evidence of Danny's innocence. Temple creates a distraction so that Danny and Wing can infiltrate the building, and the pair are able to fight off Harold's operatives. Danny follows Harold to the rooftop where they fight. Uh, Ward arrives and shoots Harold, who falls from the building to his death. Ward has the body cremated to ensure that he does not return. Joy meets with Davos and tells her that Danny must be killed. Uh, this is overheard by Gao. Danny convinces Wing to accompany him to Kung Lung, but they arrive at the gate to find it shut off from the earth and surrounded by hand bodies. And that's the end of season one. Damn. And I need some water. <laughs> yeah. I never finished season one, but I remember we watched it and I remember uh, one thing that stood out to me um, mm -hmm. a negative at least. I felt like the story was trying to kind of lead me in too many different directions with what characters were saying and how they were acting. It seemed like there was too much going on that, like, wasn't really getting resolved. Like, uh, the two siblings, one of them being all like, oh no, 
uh, well, we don't like him, but the sister being all like, oh, well, I don't know, I kind of like him, then her being all like, I don't like you. Um, and, uh, what's, uh, Iron Fist's or real name again? What's his real name again? Danny Rand. Danny, okay. Um, and Danny kind of, like, it all, I almost kind of felt like they were trying to sort of be, be all like, no, Danny is actually kind of crazy. He's not some, like, mystical hero or whatever. But, and I kept, like, they, I felt like they kept flip-flopping a little bit. I like the mm -hmm. fight scenes. But, uh. Yeah, uh. They definitely, like, this. One of the, yeah, negatives about this show is the story, like. Like, they just, like, they just didn't, like, they, they try to put so much in the show. Like, they try to do so many different angles of the show, and just, they try to give you too much at once.